Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So this time we're going to do some brick rigs. And today we are doing a brick rigs tutorial. As you guys know from the last video, I only bought this game a couple days ago. And I'm still new with it. And um, But I've learned a lot of things. Since that few days that I played this game, I played multiplayer. So there is multiplayer. So today we are going to discuss about the controls of this game. So first control is VSD. <laughs> uh, if uh, some of you or um, some of you actually plays this game and did not play first person shooter or any like normal full version games I mean your first game VSD is your control yeah because I know a lot of people who uses uh, for example these uh, arrows but the, uh, those only work for the cameras and they are not very good as you can see we're in the grid map so that's why I can show you everything without destroying buildings. I'm going to show you basic things about your character. Um, how do you shoot? You shoot, yeah. FPS fans know how to shoot. But uh, aim is more tricky because you must hold it. In some games, you can hold it. And R is reload, and you can change it, change your loadout, or exit the game by pressing escape. So I want, for example, police. I can, yeah, I can do this. I, uh, I press on civilians. I want to join them. Yeah. And spaces jump, of course. I think that everyone knows. So now we're going to the mo uh, the more important part. As you saw in last videos, I did free camera. You're questioning, how did you do this? Um, how did I do? You press F and you use VSD to move your controls. But please subscribe to my channel. It really helps um, supporting my channel and supporting me to do more videos and also hit the like button now where were we oh yeah controls so use free camera mode is F and if you want to spawn things or yourself um, you, you must press space and it shows this this bracket thing so you release it and you're still in free camera mode and you press F for example, you can do this to a vehicle, as I can show you. For example, I want this tripod. So I want to spawn it for, for example, I want to spawn it here. Yeah, so it shows you. So I want to spawn it here, you can do that. It will show you the bracket. Uh oh, I think I've just killed myself with the grinder so you can do this yeah you can do these things you can grind them you can do whatever with them yeah but these so th this is how you spawn your vehicles oh oh gonna, oh my god I'm zero percent I'm still alive it's a miracle so I take one little damage and I die. Like one little. Sorry about my grammar because um, I'm not very good at English because I, yeah, I'm not really good at it. I'm not really good at speaking. So, uh, editor, yeah, editor moving is um, right click and you use VASD to move. And also, you need to hold right click to, like, for example, move vertically. And uh, if you want to spawn in a brick, you just press on it. So those are files, looks like, and those are groups. So you need to, you want to spawn this in. Where is it? Yep, yeah, there it is. 
So, you can do this and use your mouse to to um, to control it and you can use D when you're not in a uh, right click. You can use D to move vert uh yeah, horizontally. You can use V and S or Q to rotate it. Q and E to rotate it. Now, uh, you can use shift mode. Move selection is G. So you want to move it again. So if you accidentally deselected it or you want to move it again, for example, I click on this, I can't move it, but you press G, you can move it. And yeah, you can use your. Uh, you By pressing shift, you can do this, like much faster. And also, you can make some. Yeah, you can make very, very, very precision um, corrections for some reason. Yeah, something like this. And they can make shockwaves from that. So they can make multiple stuffs by using this um, shift. And uh, G. page up, page down, moves down the object that you want to move. Yeah. So this is about how you move bricks in and in editor. And by the way, free camera. You have free camera, right? And you can move your uh, character. You can move your free cam. Now. I'm gonna press this. Now I can move my precam, but instead I can move my character. So he can do everything. Jumping, he can run. Yeah, my character can do everything. Even I can shoot in this. So I can shoot. Now, uh, you are questioning, how did you do this? Well, here in options, you say controls, you go all the way down here, camera, or you just type in camera, and there's this called toggle fixed camera. Now this toggle fixed camera, what it does, of course, mine is control F, but it actually does not appear, so it does appear that here's nothing, so you must add binding. And minus control off, you can set it whatever you want, whatever buttons you like. I just do it and I recommend it because, um, because it, so you do remember that you need to do that control F. So I'll show you again. So if you want to do an episode in, and you want your character to move, you can press control F. And your character will move. Yeah, control back, uh, F back, and your free camera moves. And by going uh, into your character, so if you do not want to spawn it, you can press F to go back. And I'm going to um, show you the last thing that you need to know about these. Uh, first is vehicles. I spawn in a tank, with some, uh, for example, this T-72. You can do this. So I'm not, I'm not going to show you how did I uh, release these tanks in this episode, but I'll show you in part two of this instruction. As I stated in earlier of this video, I'm still new to this and I'm still learning when I learn some new stuff, I gather that information and then I will make it into a, a video. Anyways, back. Uh, control, left control is your go, your gears. You can switch your gears. And uh, left shift in vehicles, you can shift your gears. For example, diesel is 4 and you go back is R2. You can go back to N. Uh, it's VSD controls. Now, it's a tank, of course. Middle mouse is uh, machine guns, uh, mostly. So, you drive 
if your thing is too slow, you switch gears, switch gears again, switch gears again, and you can move. Now, you're thinking, oh, I'm gonna shoot someone. How do you do it? Um, press left alt, and there's a little gear shows up. Now you can move. But problem with this, you can't, uh, you can move your vehicle technically but you can put handbrakes so C is camera it can only be toggled by uh, in the vehicle so if you're in a character it's it cannot be toggled so I want to shoot him this thing yeah so you do that so now I've destroyed it mm, go here and press alt again and now you free to move now I'm going to this walker that I've shut down um, you can switch to vehicles by pressing zero to me uh, I don't know what this actually means uh, where it is um, I say uh, switch yeah vehicle it's vehicle I say vehicle so there's unflip the vehicle is you. Um, I'm going for the vehicle section, and you can see the lot of things. So uh, we will discuss about uh, some of this in the next episode. Swato is uh, V and S. Steering is A and D. So I said action two is middle mouse. So these I will do it later. So what zero is cycle vehicles, yeah. I forgot about how do them call that. Cycle, you can cycle through the vehicles are in the map. So you can do this, or if I'm gonna drop it very high, and uh, for some reason I broke the vehicle, yeah. Uh, control R is complete reset on the spot. As you can see, you can reset it. Yeah, and I'm gonna, z oh, yeah, 2%. Now, back to the tank. Yeah, same same switches, everything. Now I'm gonna show you the final thing that I'm gonna show in this video is helicopters. Yes, uh, that was my caps lock. Where is it? Yeah, this. What I do is... You, s you think that you switch up the gear and this will work. No. You must enter alt mode. And you do not need to switch gears. So in alt mode, moving these choppers uh, are pretty easy in like a small creation like this. But in like a bigger creation, like a helicarrier, I saw uh, they make gunships. Like a helo gunship. It's really hard to control it. Yeah, but in this, this is uh, the, I recommend you uh, to use this chopper for practicing uh, flying a chopper or any plane. Yeah, planes. Uh, on the other hand, they have different controls. Some of them have different controls. So you want to go down, you press S and you go down. And this is uh, very simple. Want to, you want a nice landing, you yeah, hold it and press old mode off, you can exit it. Yeah. And this is what you actually do. So um anyways guys, thank you guys for watching this episode. Um please hit the like button and the subscribe button. See you guys next time. Bye.